What's going on Clash Bashers? Rocky here today and today we're back on our Let's Play Town Hall 9 and we have a ton of loot as you see up there and most of it we can't spend. However, we can spend that Dark Elixir because the last thing we have to upgrade on our Town Hall 9 is our level 22 King. We got to get him to level 30 as soon as possible. So that's what we're going to be working on today and we're also going to be working on some of our Silver Pass challenges with the dragons being there. I don't think I'm going to buy Gold Pass on this account just because I don't think I need the Valk queen skin on all my accounts and we don't have really enough to really make it worth it so i think we're just gonna go silver pass on this account this month uh before we go ahead and hop into today's video talk about more in depth of what we're doing let's go ahead and check out today's kind of question of the day coming from tricky thoughts what are the most stressful things about being a youtuber uh it's a lot of the behind the scenes stuff like for instance you know trying to figure out what to do every single day uh trying to get the video out on time every single day reading comments some of the comments uh are absolutely brutal and savage and just rude honestly some of them are just absolutely rude so some days i just don't read comments because it's just not worth the stress and then uh i don't know just just the little stuff it's the little stuff like the behind the scenes stuff about trying to you know maybe i'm not having a good day but i gotta put on that smile and be clash bashing and be happy because you know people don't want to see hey guys i'm clash bashing you know what i mean like you gotta you gotta put on the, basically the show and have a good day on camera whether you're having a good day in real life or not which it's kind of unfortunate but that's kind of the way things go but one of the biggest things is kind of being stuck playing one game like if i wanted to play a different game I can't really do it on the channel because it doesn't really get views. Other people won't watch it. So I don't know. There's a lot that kind of goes into being a YouTuber. A lot of it, the behind the scenes stuff is uh, stressful and uh, it, it can be rough sometimes. So if you guys want to submit your own comment question of the day, hashtag CQOCD down there in the comments and you might get featured in a video just like Tricky Thoughts. So let's go ahead and check out what we got going on here. Uh, obviously, we have a ton of loot. Literally, we can't spend any of the loot. Besides that Dark Elixir, the King costs us about 90,000 Dark Elixir. We do have some magic items saved up. We have a book of heroes. We have a book of everything. I think we're going we're gonna to go ahead and use some of those today. That way we can go ahead and get him going up. So let's go ahead and we'll start him going up to level 23 first. We'll use that book of heroes to get him finished off. And then we'll go ahead and we'll spend a little bit more loot. And we'll get him going up to level 24 and we'll use that book of everything. And then we need 100,000 Dark Elixir to get him going to 25, which would be absolutely awesome today. And I think we can get there. We're going to use a Dragloon strategy. I don't know if this is the right strategy to use. We might play with this throughout the video, but we do have that Dragon Challenge oops, dragon challenge going on on the Silver Pass. So we're going to start working on that, and we'll see how this goes. I'm, I'm not promising anything. It might go well. It might not go bad. It might go bad. I don't know. But we're going to go ahead. We're going to go out, find some bases, and we're going to work to get our king going to level 25 today okay guys we're gonna try this base right here i think what we can do is we might be able to have the heroes come in and kind of work out this side we do bring four wall breakers to try to get the heroes into the base if need be so i want my king to walk south perfectly oh yeah that's nice and then we're gonna try to wall breaker in here let's see if we can get some good value nice that's awesome now i don't know if they're gonna get as much as i need them to but we'll see want the king to get that air defense out get that sweeper out and then we can kind of work in through the base here all right king oh he's distracted by the enemy queen our queen is doing queen things queen oh my goodness where are you going oh my goodness that was going so well and then it went so bad all right guys uh plan c time i don't really know what plan c is uh all right we're gonna I'm gonna zap out over here. Oh, how did they not get that air defense out? That was so, so bad. Oh, I thought we were in, in a good spot, but you know, the heroes, heroes had other plans. Let's go like that. Let's get our dragons in here. Get all these balloons in. Oh man, that's so stressful and annoying. Dragons, or not the dragons, the heroes screw me over here. Uh, let's get this working here. I'm gonna go ahead and throw a freeze right in there. I'm gonna rage up here. We're gonna try to go for the Dark Elixir at this point. We're not gonna three-star this one, that's for sure. Uh, so let's go ahead and throw the freeze right in there. And then we'll kind of work through. Man, if we got that air defense down, like, that could have changed out the whole plan. King got distracted by the enemy queen. I mean, we are gonna get a solid two-star on it. We did get all the Dark Elixir 
And really, that's all we need to do with us just needing Dark Elixir, you know what I mean? So, actually, we're we're not too far off. It's just that air defense being up is going to be a real hassle. That air defense is really going to work us over. But we get, we're going to get in the 80% here. Uh, that sweeper also being a problem. If we're going to get that sweeper and air defense down, I feel like we had a shot to triple this one, honestly, guys. But... Uh, the king, he got distracted. He got distracted and screwed up the whole raid. I think we only have two dragons left, and that air defense is beating on him bad. Go, dragons! Oh, we have one dragon left. Oh, this poor dragon, he's going to go to the old wizard tower first. But we get all the dark elixir, we get our full bonus, so, I mean, I guess there's a little po positive stuff in there. Oh, that was rough. Oh, heroes. Heroes messing up everything, guys. We'll be back with our next attack. Okay, guys, we got some good Dark Elixir available on this one, and we're going to go in. I think we're going to try to get this queen out. I think that could be a positive thing if we can get the queen taken out. Let's go ahead and try to wall break her in here. All right, nice. We'll go ahead and get our wall break in. We'll get the king and queen going in. And they should hopefully... Any other time the king wants to go fight that queen, now all of a sudden he's not interested in fighting the queen. He's going to turn right here. Oh, he's coming all the way back. He's coming all the way back in to fight that queen. Level 16 queen shouldn't be too bad to take down. Our king gets through there. We'll have our queen take out that air defense. Nice. And let them work. Now, where do I actually want to go in? Either way, we're going to have to deal with sweepers, which is going to be a pain. Uh, It's a pretty symmetrical base. I think what we'll do is we'll go ahead and just zap out right here. And then we'll kind of go in this opposite side over here. Because no matter what, we have to deal with those air sweepers. And that's going to be just a pain anyway. So let's go ahead and get all of our drags in. Get our loons in. Our big boy loons out of the clan castle as well. Go ahead and throw our first rage in. Just to get working in there. That should be nice. Let's go. Uh, now, getting to that other side. That's going to be the issue. Let's go ahead and go right there with the free our rage. We'll freeze just for a sec there. We'll throw the bigger freeze in there. Oh, okay. Balloons are finally going that way. I think we're I think we're in business here, guys. The balloons were going the right way. Okay, we have dragons on the clay or on that last air defense. All right, that'll work out. So that was a little bit better. We get one of the air defenses out with the heroes. We use lightning spells to take out the other, and then the dragons and balloons take out the third and fourth air defense. So that kind of works out. And that'll lead to us getting a three-star. That's a little bit what I was going for. It was a little bit of a weaker base here. It wasn't fully maxed out, smaller heroes. But, I mean, that's uh, that's super positive. The Drag Loon doing some good things, getting us some positive loot. We also have a little bit of Dark Elixir on our Silver Pass in case we need it. But there we go. That's almost 5,000 with the bonus. That's over 5,000 Dark Elixir. And this army literally only uses eight Dark Elixir which is that one minion that I use in there for cleanup. Whoa, guys, we got some huge, crazy loot here. Holy crap. And uh, we're going to try to get in here. I'm going to go at this a little bit differently. I'm going to see if we can get out some of these archer towers with these balloons. And then I'm going to throw that right there. Get that archer tower down. Nice, perfect, awesome. And then we'll go in with our heroes here in a sec. Uh, I'm going to go king right here. Uh, let's go ahead and wall breaker in here. This loot is nuts. We definitely need to get all of it. All right, we'll go king right in there. I'm going to let him work for a second. I put that uh, minion up top that way. Uh-oh, queen. That way it can get that dark elixir right there. All right, let's see what the queen wants to do. Let's go ahead and hit the king's ability. He's going to probably walk on us. I really need the queen to go inside right here, though, and take out these two air defenses. That way we have at least somewhat of a shot. I don't think our lightning spells are going to take out all this stuff. Ugh. All right. Queen, come back. Queen, come back. Oh, my goodness. Oh, the queen's going to do queen things, guys. Oh, that's going to be rough. All right. So queen's going to walk on us. So we're going to have to try our best to get in here. I'm gonna, ugh, I, don't, I don't really even know. We're going to zap out because I don't think these are going to go down. We'll go ahead and pop the queen's ability. We're running low on time. Ooh, oh, actually, we do get one down. All right, so that'll work. Uh, let's go. Let's go with all of our drags over here. 
We'll go with that right there. We'll go ahead and rage up. Of course, now the queen wants to go inside the base. Queen, like, I gave you a perfect path to go get what you needed. And you, you ignored me. You just ignored me, queen. Alright, hopefully that enemy queen doesn't mess with us too much. I want to get that dark elixir in that core right there. There's so much dark elixir right there. Alright, go dragons, go, 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 queen. Oh, you're such a pain, queen. Why do you do these things to me? Go dragon, go dragon, go dragon, go dragon! Oh, it's so close! We got almost all the dark elixir. Alright, let's see if we can get some more of this loot. Oh, man, that was rough, guys. If the, I think if the queen goes in on this side takes out those two air defenses, I could have zapped out one of those air defenses. We would have been good. It's almost... Uh, it may almost be worth bringing one baby dragon just to help the funnel a little bit. Man, that one's so annoying because we're so close to getting all of that dark elixir. Like 8,000 dark elixir on this base. That's absolutely nuts. We're still going to work out and see what we can get because we could have went in right behind those sweepers. Man, that's such a pain. We were so close, guys. So close, but so far to so much dark elixir, especially for a Town Hall 9. That's uh, that's the kind of numbers you want to see. All right, so we'll get that out. We'll I mean, the golden elixir, we can't do anything with it. So that doesn't matter. We get the 70%, which means we get our full bonus. But we do leave 800 of the dark elixir right there. We're still going to screenshot that one. That's pretty impressive for a Town Hall 9. Do we want to add in a baby dragon, though? Maybe take out two balloons for a baby dragon? I think that might be the move, just to funnel the heroes a little bit. Okay, guys, let's give this base a try right here. We got 4,000 Dark Elixir available. Both the bows are set on ground. We do have our baby dragon in here, which we're actually going to go ahead and start with the baby dragon right here. Just like I said, to kind of funnel the heroes in. All right, so we'll go ahead and get... Once that baby dragon clears that, we'll get the king right in here. Then we'll go ahead and wall breaker right in there. Oh, just kidding. No wall break. All right, so we're going to have to settle for hopefully that air defense. Actually, we're going to go for the sweeper. I think we can deal a little bit better. Sweeper might work out. Let's see what, if we can get this queen to get this sweeper down. Sweeper goes down. She might even go back around and get that other air defense, which would be nice. All right, let's go ahead. Let's see what she's going to do here. I think she can reach that air defense. She's just got to kind of get there. All right, we'll pop her ability. Awesome. Then we're going to go in behind that other sweeper. So we're going to go ahead and... Uh, let's actually... Let's zap out right here. We're going to go... One drag right there. With a few balloons. We're going to spread our dragons in. Then I have a big drag in the clan castle. And we're going to work right on through here, guys. We'll see if that works out. I don't know. It's a little bit dicey. Uh, so let's go ahead. We get our Charizard Dragon working in there. Max level drag should be decent. We just got to get to all the air defenses now. Let's go. Get to the air defenses, guys. Those dragons up top, they shouldn't have too much to kind of contend with, rather. I was going to say defend with. That doesn't even make sense. All right. Uh... I'm just seeing what we got here. We're going to freeze that air defense here in a moment, I think. We're going to let these guys get to working. We'll freeze the air defense. I'm waiting for these other drags to get a little bit closer. We'll freeze right there. Go ahead and throw that minion in maybe as a little bit of a distraction. All right. Yeah, see, look. That minion took one shot off of the dragons. And we get all the dark elixir. That's all we need. We just need all the dark elixir. Uh, the rest is just a luxury, so that'll work out. We get 4k Dark Elixir, plus we'll get that little bit of a champ's bonus. And we might even... I think we still have enough of a shot to triple this one here. Because uh, we still have three dragons up, one of them being that max dragon. We do have to deal with that storage right there. But once that storage is out... Oh, just kidding. We lost a dragon. Once the storage is out, we are good. So let's get through. Nice. That big drag. I think uh, Clan Castle max dragon is the move. Doing some work in there. Let's get that Tesla down. And then our Max Dragon is at full health. Uh, shouldn't get taken out. I was going to say no way it gets taken out. But shouldn't get taken out. Unless there's like a couple Seekers left or something. Which would be really, really unfortunate. If we make it this th far through the base. And we lose our last Dragon. But there we go. We'll get the nice little 3 star there. And we're at 98,000 Dark Elixir. We're almost there to where we need to be to get that king going up to level 25 today. All right, guys, let's go ahead and finish up on this base right here. I'm trying to look what might make the most sense. Uh, that's a little bit rough. We're going to go Baby Dragon here. 
Uh, I don't know if there's many I can get clear right here. I might. I don't think it's going to have enough time really to work that out though. Alright, so I'm going to let that baby dragon do its thing. I'm going to put the king... Oh, so close, king. So close. I'm going to put one balloon. It might be a waste, but we're going to try to get that out with one balloon. Wall break right here. Nice. Perfect wall break. And we're going to try to get the heroes to go up inside the base. We'll see how that goes. We've seen uh, our heroes being a little bit weird today. But if they can go up in here and maybe chase down that enemy queen, that would be great. Our queen, let's see. I don't need our queen to... I'm so worried she's going to go outside and hit that cannon. Rather than go up into the base. Alright, queen, keep going. Get into the base. Alright, nice. She gets where we need her to be. Alright, she does get the cannon down. I wanted her to get that air defense, but it does not look like she's going to. And we're going to go in against that weaker air defense up top. So we'll zap quick right there. Or not zap quake. I'm so used to zap quakes in the past. We'll zap out right there. We'll go ahead and put dragons in opposite corners just to take care of those builder huts. And then we'll go ahead and get working through here. Get our drags in. Get our balloons in. We're going to go ahead and throw a rage right in there. Should get to that air defense pretty fast. We don't have clan castle troops this time. Not a huge deal. We just need to get a little bit of the dark elixir here. Uh, let's go ahead and freeze right there. That sweeper might end up actually being a problem. That back end sweeper over there. Alright, that sweeper's going down. Not the sweeper we really care too much about, but it does go down. We just need to get some of the dark elixir here since our dragons are doing all kinds of weird things and ignoring air defenses. Literally one air defense left and our dragons ignore it. That's rough, guys. That's absolutely rough. Looks like they're going to go around the far left side, so my funnel, my funneling should have been better is what that tells me. Oh, that dragon caught a seeking air mine. We do have enough dark elixir to get our king going up, just barely. But man, that last air defense being up is such a pain. Oh my goodness, oh, seeking air mine. Oh, poor dragons, catching all the seekers. We'll get this drill down. I don't think we're going to get to that last drill. There's going to be... Oh, too much time's actually gonna be a little bit of an issue also messing around with the heroes a little bit too long maybe all right there we go dragons getting through 19 seconds oh i don't think we're gonna get there guys there's only a thousand dark elixir left over there but still we want that dark elixir we don't need it today but we're gonna need it eventually oh they go to the builder hut all right we're definitely not getting it now they go to the corner hut ah oh, rough life dragons wasn't well, horrible, just the pathing could have been a little bit better. A little bit sloppy on my part. But 3600 is still not a bad raid to end on. And man, we are missing all kinds of gold and elixir. One quick thing, uh, someone in our clan pointed out, it might have been Hendo. If you don't grab like elixir or gold, you don't get it stored in your season bank. Which is really, really unfortunate, but I guess I get it. Uh, so let's go ahead, upgrade our king to level 25. Three levels on the king here today. Not too bad. We'll get him finished up. End off that boost. And we made a little bit of progress on our dragon challenge. I'll probably work on it a little bit more uh, off of the video. We also have a little bit of dark elixir in here we can grab in the future. I'm going to save that for now uh, because I just don't want to lose it. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. You guys have a great day. Keep on Clash Bashing.